Welcome back, everybody, to the KC Sports Report. I'm your host, Michael Darcy. And today I'm going to break down one of the things that Patrick Mahomes just said in his press conference. So, Chiefs Kingdom, I think that we are all very well aware that this team needs to make a trade for a wide receiver. They're just not good enough. I, I think that the idea that Juju Smith-Schuster or Xavier Worthy could be this team's number one wide receiver is a terrifying thought. I don't want to live in that world. And it seems like the Chiefs are, you know, waiting to see what they have this week against the 49ers. And if everything goes well, they might just stay pat. They might not trade for a wide receiver if Juju or Xavier Worthy or someone else in this wide receiver room steps up. Maybe they get more production from Justin Watson or Miko Hardman or, God forbid, Sky Moore does anything. So maybe they, they might not make a move depending on the outcome of this Sunday's game. But Patrick Mahomes was asked about his confidence in the wide receivers, and he said this about, you know, what he thinks. He said that he has, quote, extreme confidence in the pass catchers around him and thinks Brett Veach has done enough for the Chiefs to have the, quote, the best ability to win, end quote. So Patrick Mahomes believes that Brett Veach has done everything that he could to put this team in a position to have the best ability to win. I think that is an outlandish statement. I, I don't think that he has done enough. I think that if we just watch all these wide receivers get traded in the conference and see all of these other AFC rivals get better, if we see that and Brett Veach does not make a move, it has been an ultimate failure. He has failed this team because how many times are you going to have a chance to go for a three-peat? How many times? Clearly, it does not happen that much. And so for the Chiefs to be in this position and be a wide receiver or two away from legitimately being a scary team in the AFC, I, I think if Brett Veach doesn't do that, uh, listen, heads are not going to roll, but we're going to have to have some serious conversations because it's just unacceptable to not put the necessary talent around Patrick Mahomes when he's the guy that's going to get us there. Just give him the necessary pieces and... And he can get us there. He's shown that he can win a Super Bowl with MBS and Sky Moore. Like, like that is impossible, but he found a way to do it. And so I know in that press conference, he says that, you know, he has extreme confidence in his guys. And, you know, he feels like Brett Veach has done a good, you know, great job of putting talent around him. While he says that to the media, that cannot be how he's actually feeling. Because you have too many guys in this wide receiver room that have been a non-factor. Sky Moore, non-factor. Miko Hardman, non-factor. I mean, who's it going to be? Nico Remigio and Justin Ross? Are they going to be the solution to your problem? No. You've got to find a way to trade for a wide receiver. And, and listen, I understand that Mahomes doesn't out his guys. That's why he's so great as a leader. He's not going to come out and say, yeah, these guys suck. We need somebody else. Like, I, I like Juju. I like Xavier Worthy. I don't think that you can win a Super Bowl with those two guys leading the charge. I, I just don't think you can. I think that Juju kind of caught lightning in a bottle, and he's going to have to do it consistently for me to believe in him more. But also, he's aging. He's got knee issues. Do you think he's going to be healthy 15 weeks from now? The Chiefs already have all of these injuries to the wide receiver room. Juju Smith-Schuster is one bad hit away from not playing again. And I guess all of these guys are. But Juju Smith-Schuster is an injury risk. And so if you can find a way to trade a you know low-round draft pick to get a Deontay Johnson, to get somebody like a Darius Slayton from New York, you're going to have to find a way to get somebody to make this offense better. And listen, Brett Veach isn't stupid. Brett Veach watches Sky Moore play football. He's seen how this offense has functioned. I do not think that he is going to sit on his hands and not do anything. Now, I understand there are some Chiefs fans that are frustrated that they didn't make a move for, you know, Devontae Adams or, you know, Amari Cooper who went to the Bills. I think that there's a couple guys that are still in play. Obviously, Deontay Johnson from the Carolina Panthers. DeAndre Hopkins is still out there. It might make sense. I don't know how big the Chiefs are going to shoot. But Hopkins is in the final year of his deal. There really wouldn't be much cap hit. I think it would make sense. But what would it take to acquire DeAndre Hopkins? That's the question. And, and maybe they're holding out hope that Hollywood Brown comes back for the playoffs. 
But guys, I, I, I don't like the opportunity or the odds of us betting on Hollywood Brown's return in the playoffs and him being a impact wide receiver right away. I think that is a foolish thing to believe. So you've got to go out and trade for a wide receiver. Nate Taylor of The Athletic has already said that the Chiefs are kind of waiting to see what they have in the wide receiver room, which I don't understand what you're waiting for. You kind of know what you have out of all of these guys. They've been like this all season. So I think that we're waiting to trade for a wide receiver. After this San Francisco game, I expect a trade to be made. I, I fully expect a Deontay Johnson or a Darius Slayton to be in Kansas City after the result of this 49ers game. So hopefully only a couple more days until we have some trade rumors, some, some stuff that's heating up. But I think that the Chiefs need to make a move for a wide receiver in order to compete in 2024. So Chiefs Kingdom, what do you guys think about this? You know, about this. Do you think the Chiefs need to make a trade for a wide receiver? What do you think of Patrick Mahomes' confidence in Brett Veach and the wide receivers? Because I understand why he has it, but at the same time, he's not going to tell the media that he doesn't have enough talent around him to win a Super Bowl. So I think Brett Veach has his hands full and he's got his work cut out for him. But if anybody can do it, it would be Brett Veach. So Chiefs Kingdom, that's all I have for this video. If you guys enjoyed it, hit that like button. Subscribe for more Chiefs content. I've been posting stuff each and every single day. And if you enjoy that, share it so more Chiefs fans can find it. And hit the like button on this video. It really helps me out. Go follow me on social media, Instagram and TikTok, KC underscore sports report. And Twitter at KC sports report. Until next time, guys, thank you for watching this video. And go Chiefs.